<laughs> yes! Hello people! Dean here from 075 and you are joining us on our annual trip to the Picos! Enjoy the ride with us! We're going to. We've got uh, five days in the Picos de Europa. We we're picking up the ferry this evening. It's Sunday, the 22nd of September. And we've been looking forward to this for a number of months. We're just going down to McDonald's to see Dave. Because, and then we'll just go have a bite to eat there. And then we'll thought we'll just take the back roads down towards uh, Portsmouth. In front is my brother on his KTM SMT. And we've got a week away from our families. My wife doesn't mind. She says it's one less kid to worry about. Yeah, thanks darling. Love you too. <laughs> Let's go and grab some munchies. Where is he? There he is. Let's Hello! Start the camera. <laughs> start on the adventure. Yeah. Well, Looking forward a to trip. it. A trip. A trip. Trip to the Picos. A week trip. Be fun, wouldn't it? A little blast over the old seas. Yeah. Can't wait. 32 hours on a ferry. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> Yeah, go. You ready, Dave? Cool. We're going. Do you want to lead? Go on, Leary. Day from 075 and welcome back. We are on our way down to Portsmouth and we cannot wait to get there. Ferry didn't leave to our past time, but we thought we'd get there about 8 o'clock and uh, and uh, just uh, mill around a little bit um, to have a chat, relax, and that's what it's all about. But uh, we've got about an hour and a half to kill, so what we're going to do is we're going to, instead of going down the A27, which is quite boring, we're going to go over the back towards uh, Petersfield, Petworth, and then try and hit the A3 and then head down that way. So at least we've got uh, some nice roads on the A272. Before we've got about an hour's worth of daylight, start, sun's starting to set, so it's quite in your eyes. But it should make for a lovely evening ride down towards Portsmouth. So I've just left Shoreham, and that sun is setting, and it's beautiful. This is gonna make for a lovely week if the weather holds up like this. Dave in front. Hello, David. Midhurst at night, lovely. Well, eight o'clock now, and we're just arriving into Portsmouth. Ferry and cruise. Oh, why? New bus, I'm leaving first gear. He won't get the first gear. Bill Bell, Bill Bell. We'll have a, oh, enjoy these other motorcycle lays. Right, you ready? Ready? Right, we're coming over here. Oh, 
could uh, I think we could be in for a bit of a security check. <laughs> They've got a whole load of bikers, the helmets off and everything. Going straight through, thank you. Oh, we're not getting security stopped. I'd like to join in with you by holding the camera. <laughs> Right, let's go back to the boys. Right, I'm good to go for the day then. Oh, it's getting some cold air. Always takes a moment or two to find your feet. But once they're there, we're there. Look, it's dry here. Yeah? Oh, it's cooling down. I have got a soggy wet t shirt. Sitting in the bow of that ferry, and it's just, it must have been about 35, 40 degrees Celsius down there. 54.3! <laughs> No wonder I've got more uh, I've got more fluid externally to my body than I have internally. 
Signal 644. N anything with N6 sounds like a good road to me. Uh, we've got to come off at this junction here, so I was just hanging behind this uh, this truck. Because we've got to do a left, uh, do a righty. I'm going to keep doing that for the rest of the week. Do a left when I mean right and right when I mean left. N644. Oh, this is cooling down a bit now. What's the temperature now? I can't see it on my bike. 23. Got a couple of problems that my GoPro 7, not totally happy about that, but uh, hopefully I've tried to resolve the issue by uh, swapping cameras and making sure things are working fine again. Well, I think it's probably just down to uh, low battery power, let's just have to wait and see. So we've um, about an hour in or so from Bilbao, um, we've picked up a, a few roads, I think we're on the, uh, the currently the BI630. Um, which is absolutely a fantastic road. I'm going to try and recover what footage I have. My brother's been recording, so I've got some backup there, so I shouldn't have to worry too much. But anyway, so we've had uh, a bit of a guess on how many corners and routes we're going to, or how many <laughs> corners we're going to be doing over the next week or so. And we've um, all had, uh, all hedged our bets. We've placed our bets, and this is what we're going to do. I've gone for lots, Phil's gone for loads. And Dave, oh no, Dave's gone for loads and Phil's gone for plenty. Yeah, see how things go, <laughs> too many. So yeah, B610. And the sun is out! Wee! <laughs> After slightly drizzly starts of the morning, we are now enjoying beautiful sunshine. There we go. Ah. Oh. 22.3 at the moment. Is it? Nice. Yeah, end of September 2019. Arrived in Bilbao. What's today's date? It's the 20, 24th. Yeah, we jumped on the ferry on the 22nd. <laughs> We've spent 33 hours on the ferry. And now we're here. <laughs> Oh, beautiful! So yeah, if you want to have a focus, focus your time in Potes, head south out of Bilbao, and then pick up the. Uh, well, what I'll do, what I'll do is I will upload to the description at the end of the videos the routes that we're doing, so you can download the GPX files and use that for your reference later on but I'll do my best to name all the roads I can but I've had a, a bit of a video uh, cock up GoPro so it's not working correctly Let's see how it goes may these hills continue <laughs> No, we've built the VI630. And the scenery just constantly changes. Absolutely beautiful. N629. On the N629, anything that starts N6 is really good. Back again after stopping for a bit of a cafe con leche and a Coca Cola. And we're on the CA256. Back on these superb roads of Spain. <laughs> Come on, 
Clean out. Let's get going. Yes. Bunk down, lorry. Slow up. Right there. Twisties. They're bonkers. Oh, spoiling our fun. Oh, it's moving over. Oh, what a chat. Oh, it's probably going in there anyway. Oh, look at that. Thank you. What a top man. See, that's Spanish drivers for, even the professional ones. Climbing up there, yeah. stunning, look at that. <laughs> oh my god. Beautiful. Oh wow. Oh, can I have a take here, chat? I'll go for it. Two, five, six. Oh, I'm glad I got in front of that car. See what's coming up. It's a mess. It's a mess, people. <laughs> oh man, these roads are just bloody epic. Hairpin coming up. <laughs> this bike was made for this road. Flip. Well, just turn left on the, the CA665. Don't know where it's going to, but we're going up to an altitude of about 1200 metres. But stunning is not a word that describes this place enough, really. Fantastic. Oh, I've got a few squigglies coming up. Okay, six, six, five. Uh, okay. Oh, right, tight, 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 tight. There's a problem. Actually, good place to stop here. Good place to stop. Uh, Car pack. You all right? Blimey, boys. They're, those mountains aren't funny. They're hilarious. I can hear that wind. That's worrying. Hey! 
Ти че сте дичи. И не рифт. Колко ми лонг е. Къде е пейпо? Just come out that road down there. This is a CA665. Oh. <laughs> oh, I think we'll just do a bit of a fuel stop and then I think that will do us for today because we've got about 150 miles to go, which actually times it out well because our fuel tank range is is about 660 miles. Oh. I know we're mainly focusing around the peak course, but come a little bit further afield. But this is a brilliant road to get there. God, I've only got one battery to go. I think we're going to do that one as well. Just grabbing way too much footage. <laughs> oh man. The sun's out. The roads are wet and dry. Two on the road. Love it. Look at that. Let's get so high now. Horse, looking funny. Uh -oh. Horsey, hello, horsey. Is that all your poo back there? Is it? Yes, yeah, yes. You dirty boy. And the camera goes on again. <laughs> I can't turn it off. This road, BU571, what an epic road this is. That's bloody wind turbines. There you are, we're at the uh, summit now. Let's see a 1200 metres. There we go. Wow. Whoa. Someone's coming up. Oh, turn the camera back on again. These roads are too good. Sharp left. <laughs> epic, absolutely epic. Screw 
goes. God, too, I'm not going to be right. Whoa! Whoa! Slipped. Ah! Oh. That was really slippy. That was poo on the road then. Slightly damp. Ah, oh, my leg. Ow! Oh, got the top of my thigh. So right, I'm all right. I'm all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, just, just caught me. Okay. Oh. Yeah, my, I think uh, Mitchell and Road Fires have just lost a notch. <sighs> oh, great, so you're riding along these beautiful, stunning roads. Amazing. Just reminds me of, you know, Wales, really. But just better. <laughs> well, so, what are we on? We are on CA263. And we just come over a, a crest. It's 1200 metres high. And it was also a squeaky bum moment because I was running out of fuel. We just stopped off at a fuel station, filled up, and on our way again. Kilo Road, eight two six three. Well, chaps, that was an amazing road. That was the CA263 from San Pedro. Now we're on the 623 towards Santander. So I'm going to go. So I'm going to go north. Here we go. Oh, we're coming off the uh, N2, N623. We're going to go left up the CA271. Oh, well, the scene is great. There's loads of twisties. The road surface is not that great at all. You don't have to watch yourself on this one. Do climb quickly though. Straight road, we haven't, we haven't seen one of these for a while. Oh, I picked up a road which uh, doesn't have a number, it's called Barrio Alsa. Road surface is not too bad either. Travel quite quickly. Yeah, it's got some walls. I don't know which way he's going. I don't know. Should we? He's moving out of the way. Oh, good boy. Oh, lovely. It's a girl, by the way. Thank you. Oh, bless. Yeah, I thought for a moment it was a standoff. a hydroelectric power station going on here and then there's a lake there's a reservoir or something on the other side those bloody pipes going up there Yeah, let's stick with it. Look, if it's on maps, we'll do it. But we'll cover somewhere where no one else would come. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, a bit of off roading, chaps. A bit of track while we're here. Yeah, oh crikey, that's a bit of a dip. This is where we don't need to have a puncher. 
Oh, Clarky, you all right? Go this way, go this way. Yeah, yeah, it's not too bad up here, chaps. I certainly don't want to punch her. Not here. Look at that for view. Yeah, after a little excursion, a little bit of off tracking, or trekking. <laughs> I was uh, getting a little bit worried there, I wondered how uh, rough that was going to be, but uh, bikes and us, we took it our stride. Job done, back on the tarmac. So we're going to hopefully join up with the CA716, which will then take us back to the N611, I believe. So, yes, yeah, let's crack on. Beautiful. Going to turn the road all the way down the bottom and then join the N611. Just on the A67, just going to try and cut across to the CA171. So on the CA625 and it's typical what we experienced when we were last here. We're in the clouds. That said, it's not damp. And I can feel the sun creeping on through. So a little bit, a little bit higher, we should break through over this cloud. It only takes one corner in this place. Look, see what I mean? <laughs> yep. I certainly feel that temperature drop. No, and it was uh, wet, very wet. Okay, we can't see anything! <laughs> it is that dense. Literally, well, within two minutes. Yeah, please do, Phil. Like, yeah. Oh, there I can see now. It is just clouds. Um, it's not damp or mist or anything. Well, of course, it's gone very dark as well. Ooh. Yeah, oh, there's a bridge or something around here. Bloody hell. Well, since there's not much to see here, there's no point recording it. <laughs> Ooh. Well, I hit a cracking bit of road. We've just come out the uh, the clouds, which completely missed our view. Now we're below the cloud line. It's not a bad road, actually.
CA282 that was given us. It's like God shining down. Oh. CA2, the CA282 is a brilliant road in itself. Yeah, what a day to finish uh, the first day of riding all the way down from Bilbao. A mecca for motorcyclists. Look, just like, look, look at the peaks right, right through there, and there's more with clouds nestled in between. Oh, what just goes on? Oh.